value Christ over your life, man. Uh, I know many people probably already seen this video, but again, I just wanted to make, you know, kind of re put it back into y'all faces, you know, kind of, you know, the reason why, because what Black China is doing, she's exposing who she was working for, you know, who she was, uh, and obviously, I don't know, I can't even remember if she was a rapper, but, you know, the, all these people in the hip-hop industry, movie industry, the entertainment industry, period, they all, birds of a feather flock together. They all take upon that same, you know, uh, that same vibe. But it just reminds me of the uh, Amos, where it says, how can two walk together? At least they be agreed, you know? Um, and that's questionable. You know, it's questionable to me because we look at these people and... Because of the profession that they are in, not only that, I know it's a it's a whole lot outside of that. That is uh, the reason why we don't believe them is because many of y'all are under demonic influence by these rappers and by these, you know, ent entertainers, uh, influencers. This is what you know. This is who Satan gets to put you under demonic influence. <laughs> literally, Black China just showed that. She literally showed it, said what the Baphomet was, uh, all of the things that the Baphomet means. And man, she brought so much to my understanding. I definitely got to do a reaction video on that. But uh, yeah, I just wanted y'all to look at this video and, and, and continuously look around because Lil her Juice World, Trippy Nine or Trippy Red, whatever his name is, all of them together at the same time. And, you know, us. Being in the flesh and not wanting to see what's right in front of our eyes. People are going to try to make an excuse. We don't know what they were doing. They probably were shooting the video. They never showed a video ever, a rap video with Lil Trippy Red, Lil Herb, and uh, Juice World. I haven't seen a video that had the same type of similar background, the same type of uh, scenery or anything. So to me, I know for sure. I know for sure. And it is why he, you know, this is why they... Pretty much promoted and just threw it in our faces. It's something that the enemy would have them do. But uh, this is why his soul, you know, this is why Satan came to collect. I want to know what y'all think about it. You know, you know, just due to what all is happening in the world right now. And this is me pretty much basically being mild for those who are in the world. I'm just trying to show y'all how, you know, these dudes that y'all are going to for peace and going to for advice and listening to their worldly advice. Because I see Lil Herb got a lot of videos where he's giving worldly advice, but all that worldly advice is vain. He's not telling y'all anything that'll actually help you gain the wisdom that it takes for you to enter the kingdom of heaven. But sadly, people are not worried about the kingdom of heaven. They are worried about joining the industry that these people are in and not even understanding the ending that awaits these people. That's why the most high Yahuwah said, what does it profit a man to gain the world and to lose his soul? But what shall a man give in exchange for his soul? These people are giving their lives for the world. They're giving their lives. They're giving their, you know, uh, what Christ bought us with. They giving that body over to Satan. And that's how they get the world. But Christ wants us to give him our body. That's why he said, you must live, uh, um, you know, you must live your life like unto a living sacrifice so he can operate out of you. And so now you're not obvious. You're not only, you know, building treasures in heaven, but you're, you know, letting him operate out of you. So others who are in dark can see the light through you and now follow the light. Follow the righteous path. Follow the path that, you know, it be very few that find that path. These rappers are literally, uh, um, a lot of them are deceived. Some of them might be tears. But, you know, value Christ over your life. Value life over the image that these rappers are painting. Because we are in the end times. This spiritual war is, 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 is in effect. Many people are dying. The sad thing is their death will be in vain. Many people are honoring God, honoring Christ. But sadly, that honoring will be in vain. Because it's not what you say with your mouth that Christ wants to uh, uh, hear and obviously prayer and those things, uh, uh, fervent prayers and availeth much. We know that. And it doesn't take away from you, you know, communicating and building a relationship with your God. But he wants to see action. We must be doers of the word, not only readers of the word. And that's what the world is vexing us away from because we are looking from and and and. and at taking advice from those who were literally sent to crush 
you know, crush our spirits with their worldliness. That's why many of us can't see them for who they are because you are crushed in spirit. You're blinded in spirit. And thanks to Lil Herb, thanks to Juice World, thanks to King Vons, thanks to Lil Dirks, thanks to the Yo Gotti's of the world, to the Gucci Mane's of the world, the Glow, Glow Rillas, the City Girls, to all these people. We have great thanks to Cardi B's, the Miley Cyrus's, the, uh, all these people. Who gained the world and lost their soul. We have them to thanks for our kids and for us being misled and for us being a hurt and for us being deceived. We got those idols that we look to for peace, for advice, for fun, for entertainment to thank. But I don't anymore because I let them go. I will not be blind following the blind. I hope that y'all join me on the one righteous path that leads to everlasting life. Because these people are on a one way, one way street, but it's so broad and it's so uh you know, it's so wide that they don't even know that where it leads to because everybody's doing it. But if the whole world is doing it, then you got to know it's not of God because God said, if the world hated you, then remember it hated me. So if the world is loving you, then that must mean that you are of the world because the world ain't hating. It's not, I mean, the world is not loving what's uh, 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 the truth because the truth condemns y'all world. <laughs> Value Christ over your life, man. Stay prayed up. Stay blessed up.